hi to Chaco. So we have a blade master for who? Well, for uh, for Cash. Cash is going for a blade master. What do we have for Foggy? A demon hunter and a moonball and an ancient of war and a wisp. Wisp goes into the tree. And there's an archer, guys. There she is. This other wisp also in a tree, guys. And the archer's out. Angel of War on his way. The archer gets lightning shielded because she was standing next to this wisp here that's in a tree. So this guy, he thinks he's smart. The renegade wizard thinks he's smart. Of course he's a wizard. He is smart, but he wasn't as smart as he thought he was. Uh, like he thought like he was smart by by lightning shooting the wisp, so the wisp would kill the wi uh, the uh, by lightning shooting the archer. He thought the archer would kill the wisp, but the archer instead uses the lightning shield against him. Uh, thanks for thanks to back to Warcraft for hosting me. Come uh, Samida, Neo, and hope you had a good time, or hope you're having a good time there in Sweden. Hello, I watched uh, the stream earlier, of course, today. The blade master over here. There's a grunt blocking uh, the base because he wants to build this burrow. He doesn't hasn't built a burrow yet. He will build one in a moment, guys. In a moment, we'll see a burrow somewhere. There it is. And this grunt, make sure that the demon hunter cannot just walk in and cancel it. There he is. There's Mr. Demon Hunter. Is he going to walk in and cancel it? Well, if you paid attention, you know the grunt is in the way. So you know he's not going to walk in and cancel it. Ring of Protection and Gauntlet of Ogre Strength makes him pretty difficult to kill. The Grunt here just defending. The Blade Master gets that kill. He gets a Gauntlet as well. He Mikasa is Mikasa, guys! Mikasa going back home to defend his base. Use heal healing self on himself. This Burrow taking the damages, though. Can he can he cancel it? It's already, a, a, you know, it's almost up. And there's Mikasa. And Mikasa, you know, she's pretty strong. And... Uh, Oh, I thought he was going to surround this demon hunter with the peons. Uh, I think they would have been smart there. But, yeah, because I... Okay, well. Meow! Nice stuff. Uh, uh, TP out here by the blade uh, demon hunter. And I think he, what he tried to do there was not get his archer to TP out. So he could block the blade master in and the grunt in. But, you know, the demon hunter was too close to the archer. So the archer TP'd with him. Right? There was no... There's no dust on the blade master. So if he was actually stuck in his base with the grunt... Like, how do you get out? You have to wait till daytime. But that filled. Uh, uh, the meow. I heard a meow. But let me read that meow later. I'll read the meow after this game. Because there's so much excite. Hey, do you have contacts uh, of NW NWC3L admins? I think so. A player's forces are I mean. Attack. Blade Master, go for the first little berserker. I pretty much have... Uh, Context with all the work of three people, guys. Is Archer hiding over there? But is, does she see the Blade Master? I'm not sure. Yeah, I, uh, I think she did. Yeah, yeah, yeah. She's a troll now. Ancient of War walking. Demon Hunter. So over there. We are, we're almost a tree of ages. Almost. And then we we'll see. What do we see? He has a staff. He's just going to staff in the base, isn't he? That's why he's standing here by. Okay, he's by staff of preservation. There's the Beastmaster. He kind of wants to give the Straff of Preservation to the Beastmaster first. There's no tier 2 going up yet. But he's preparing, guys. He's preparing to do the masterful foggy move. A player's forces are under attack. Where he cancels tier 2. Foggy. Oh, this peon is... is he, he's too late to block the piggy. The demon will staff into the base. And the piggy, of course, also in the base. He was so... It was so clutch. Almost, almost Cash got there in time with the peons. But he didn't uh, not stop to stop him out right now. I think there's no reason to stay, is there? I mean, what's, what's he doing? He's trying to kill this grunt, I guess. Okay, well. Hello? Demon Hunter's dead. Okay, Foggy lets the Demon Hunter die. Complete mistake. We have a staff of preservation here on the Beastmaster. Too greedy, <laughs> trying to get this grunt. Uh, the grunt, of course, survives. No problem. Healing self. Spiritor's going back up. Beastmaster going home and cry that he just lost his best friend, but it's, it's fine. He will be back. He will be back unlike in real life when you lose your best friend in real life. He remains dead, guys. But in this game, in this game, he will come back. There's Blade Master, Mikasa. 
Mikasa, she can kill, he, yeah, she can kill Piggy or a Cobalt. The Sentry War sees Mikasa though. Mikasa fighting against Gazi Bortusk. Is Piggy still alive? Oh, Mikasa gets that one. Mikasa almost level three. Bortusk, 92 XP. Nice 88 critical strike. Uh, the Blade Master and the Grunts going for the Ancient of War. Ancient of War taking so much damage here. Oh, is it death, guys? Phew, phew. Bye bye, Ancient of War. Bye bye, guys. Well, Mikasa with the healing self. There's a TC. The Beastmaster here. You know, going, uh, you know, trying to kill what? The Blade Master? Blade Master with Fairy Fire takes so much damage, of course. So he's trying to kill this Blade Master with a piggy. But it will take some time before a piggy kills Mikasa. Okay, he wakes up the creeps and Mikasa kills the piggy. He's level 3. Demon Hunter's back. Welcome back. Here are the Ancient of Winds. Uh, these guys are already adept. He's almost a Tree of Eternity. This archer is just sitting there. Standing even. Uh, she has a standing desk. Not the sitting one like I have. Uh, there's an ensnare. Oh, do we have another engagement? No. Spirit Walkers. Blade Mash, Mikasa, level 3. TC, 0 XP still. Mully, Mully Stormhoof. Is that why he names himself Stormhoof? Look at this! Cash in game name is Stormhoof. He named himself after the TC. I just now realized that. Hello. I didn't know Cash was a TC in real life. He always seemed more like a Blade Master to me in real life. I have never seen him in real life, of course, but. You know. With, with a name like Cash. It's just such a, a thrifty name. But now he names himself Stormhoof. He reveals his true character. He reveals his his cow self. Uh, quack. Okay, well. People buying items, selling items. Nice dust here. The Blade Master gets Mana Bird in the face for 50. The piggy here tanking the Sasquatch. There goes the troll. Blade Master. I mean, it, there's no master yet, but soon. Blade Master gets the last hit. Mikasa gets the last hit. So far, Cash is playing a beautiful game, guys. Hello, Chaco. Hello, Rawful. There's the master, Druids of the Talon, guys. There it is. Mikasa level 3. Mully level 2. Whoa. So, what a game. TC level 2. Mikasa level 3. Terror Blade level 2. Gazi level 1. Here are the Druids of the Talon, guys. The Master Druids of the Talon. <laughs> the TC here gets a rope of the Magi. Not the best item in this matchup, but it's. It might make a difference later in this game. If we even get a level 3 TC. This might be the game deciding uh, fight. Once Spirit Walker goes down, the TC is flying. This uh, Druid of the Talon here dies. Of course, and we have this Archer still alive as well. It is now 46. Okay, 46 supply. Cash doesn't have the supplies he needs to win this game, guys. Nice round to the level 2 TC. Does he have items? Nothing to save himself. Well, a Shockwave is nice. This Raider here takes a lot of damage. This uh, Berserker takes a bit of damage. Oh, the Raider goes down. This Archer, she's just killing you in this... She's just a hunter, guys. She's a hunter. Doesn't remind you of uh, Hearthstone? Like uh, the guy with the bow. Taco Flavor Keys. Oh, thank you after the game as well. This TC is dead. This Raider here, totally dead as well. Beastmaster level 2. There goes Grunt. This is looking. Oh, the Archer. Look at this. She just knocked out this Spirit Walker. He's dead. GG. First game goes to Foggy. It looks like it went so well here for Cash. Hello. So we have a Blade Master here and Grunts, of course, for Cash. Uh, Foggy, uh, Brutus is ancient war. He's gonna eat it. Uh, he's, he's eating a tree. Very nice. Demon Hunter here, almost, almost out. Moonwall, does he build a second Moonwall somewhere, sometime in the future, somewhere? This archer is shooting this ogre warrior. Yeah, he goes down close with haste. Of course, he had to wait for his Demon Hunter to show up. He couldn't kill him too early. Then he doesn't get XP. Of course, Foggy will never make that mistake. But I'm just saying, wait, what just happened? Did he just cancel something? 
Did you just cancel? Oh, yeah, yeah, yeah. no, of course. Uh, this new build order that Night Elves do. I'm not actually sure how new it is, but they they build a shop, cancel it, so they can build one more wisp. And look at Foggy, he's supply stock. 21 out of 20. And uh, he did scout with the wisp. He saw there was a one burrow attack, so he knows it's safe to just attack with one moon wall. Now he builds the second one very late. Uh, Blade Master could cancel it, but he's not going to. Right, because he has no healing salves. He has to go back to his base. He has to defend against his evil demon hunter. And Foggy can just attack so aggressively. And this is just, you know, this just wins you games, guys. This early game just wins you games. That Foggy just did. Just, if you're a Knight of player and you want to know how to win games. Against the Orc, uh, in this case, of course. You know, scout your opponent with a Wisp. If you see a one barrel attack, you can go a one moon wall attack. But 21 supply. There's a healing self on the grunt. Nice. Is Team Hunter coming in? No, not coming in. Burrow's going up. Uh, is this even open? I don't even know. This doesn't look open to me, actually. Is this open? He could cut away one tree, I guess. He could leave this closed. Build this tier 2 over here. Build a one, uh, Cut down the tree when he needs it. Blood Draft. Almost level 2. There's a Slippers of Agility, Demons will pick it up. And these Murlocs are dead, guys. These Murlocs are just dying. Blood Wrath. Killing Murlocs. So fast. Jubei. Killing this Forceful High Priest. There's a 33, uh, 33 Mana Burn. Nice attack there by the Blade Master. Not a nice attack on this Demon Hunter. So the Demons are level 2. <laughs> he attacks so fast, very fast. Close of Haste, Slippers of Agility. Blade Master actually has the same amount of agility now with the Circlet. He also has a Close of Haste. So actually they have uh, pretty similar items. Pretty similar attack speed. And pretty similar damage. Of course the Blade Master is level 1. So he doesn't have critical strike. Has a li little bit less hit points. The Demon Hunter though has uh, evasion. He would win a one-on-one -on -one fight if he fought. But there's the Beastmaster. Wait, does he have all the items? The staff? Yeah, double staff. Means he's going to castle again. But let's see. Oh, look at this. Look at Cash, guys. Look at Cash not making the same mistake twice. Oh, never mind. Okay. Hello. Hello. Is what Cash has to say. Hello. How come the piggy just sneaks past this stupid grunt man? And of course, they, uh, the building gets cancelled. Spirit Lodge gets cancelled. This archer now standing over there. The demon hunter here with the two piggies going for this grunt. This grunt taking so much damage. This grunt, is he going to die maybe sometime? Yeah, this is, inst this is actually close and he didn't realize. He wanted to save his grunt, but he couldn't because it's, it was close. And now these other grunt also dying. He does have a TP. Remember, last game, the early game went well for Cash and he lost so one-sidedly. This game, the, the early game just looks so good here for Foggy. And he can block this base still. The Blade Master is now stuck. Uh, yeah, this game, the early game looks so good for Foggy. And, you know, of course he's going to win this game easy peasy. TC has to buy some dust so he can kill this archer or go to the laboratory. Either one is fine. And the demons are already creeping. This is looking so bad for cash, guys. But maybe, maybe, uh, maybe what? I don't know what we're hoping for. I don't know what we're hoping for, guys. But yeah, a comeback, of course. Hello. But I'm trying to say is what kind of com how does he make this comeback? He doesn't realize he didn't realize it was close and he still doesn't, I think. Or maybe uh, this radio will tell him. Hello, cash. Don't forget about me. Woof, woof. Woof, woof. He's destroying this tree. Okay, maybe he realized it's close, but he's going for this tree instead of this tree. Uh, which is uh, fine, but only if he moves his peons now out of the way. <laughs> out of the way. Uh, actually, is that fine? No, the raider's still stuck because he cannot go through this little gap. So he's gonna cut this tree as well. <laughs> wow. Cash, nice base, Kappa. Blade Master and the TC just uh, doing their thing. Doing their thing, guys. This demon hunter almost level 3. He gets a boost of Quotalas. Are you kidding me? That's what he got from over there. He has now 32 agility. 
Best item he could have gotten, of course, over here that he could have gotten for sure. There's no better item for uh, Foggy in this matchup that you can get from this creep camp. TC going for the Ogre Magi. Blade Mass helping the Ogre Magi a little bit to gather the creeping and stuff. There's a uh, Druid of the Mass Talon Master training for Master Druids of the Talon. Demons are level 3. I'm out of water. I said that before I took the last sip of my drink. So actually I'm out of water now. I was out of water before. Uh, he <laughs> used the wrong staff by accident on the Beastmaster. Cancels it of course. Used the correct staff. But now this one has a cooldown. I don't think it matters. I don't think he was planning to use it in the near future. Now Beastmaster almost level 3. These heroes are still just level 2 and completely spaghetti. Look at these spaghetti heroes. Hello. This is not even just a normal plate of spaghetti. This is like a, a plate of spaghetti that you uh, just dropped on the floor. It's like all tangled up and useless. This Blade Master attacks pretty fast though. 29 agility and two gloves of haste. This Demon Hunter has, sure, he has 34 agility, but no more gloves of haste. He sold it or gave, gave it to the Naga. Oh, we have the Naga third. Whenever we see Naga third for Foggy, I've never seen him lose a game. Never in my life, guys. In my life, I've oh, there goes the shop. Did he uh, get a sapper or something? No, I don't think so. He just destroyed it. Uh, there, the master Jews of Dalen. So he gets the Naga third whenever he has a good advantage, and he just thinks he can add the game early. And yeah, like I, I just said, I've never seen him lose with that Naga. He's just killing burrows. All the burrows are going down. Team Hunter might put back. Um, the Naga has TP, right? Or the Beastmaster? Beastmaster has a TP, so he can TP whenever. Whenever, guys. He doesn't want to lose the Demon Hunter, hello? Maybe, uh... Okay, tries to stop out. Yeah, he could have TP'd earlier, but now he lost his uh, Demon Hunter, and he cannot rebuild him, can he? Uh, no. He's Supply Stock. He could maybe detonate one Wisp real fast, try to rebuild him, but... No, doesn't go for it. But it doesn't matter. He killed all the peons. I mean, it does matter. Wait, it matters a lot, but what I'm trying to say is you probably still win. Ah, there goes Raider, and there comes everyone, guys. <laughs> this army is so hurt just from killing a base. Is this the entire army for Foggy? It's not that big either. GG, that game went, went to Foggy. He goes to the finals. Foggy's in the prize money. Happy's in the prize money as you guys expected of course foggy and happy go to the finals as expected this is what we always expect